Hi guys, welcome to third grade, chapter 12, lesson three. We're gonna go ahead and get started. Um, so it says, is the shape a polygon, right? Yes or no? Well, a polygon is defined as a closed plane shape that is made up of line segments. So you have to have straight lines and that they are they meet up only at their end points, okay? So, like right here, okay? So, this one has multiple sides, and they meet and intersect at all of their points. So this one is a yes, okay? Now, you just heard me say that a polygon has to be a closed shape. That is open, right there. That is a no, sir. And number four, okay, remember it has to have those straight sides that meet at a corner. So this one, not so much, okay? So now, we're gonna go down to number five and it says to write the number of sides and the number of angles. Remember that those two numbers match. So if you have one or two sides, then you should have two angles. If you have two, or sorry, if you have six sides, you should have six angles. Eight sides, eight angles, okay? They should match. This one has one, two, three, four, five, six. So both of them will be six. You guys go ahead and do number six. We're gonna go down and do number seven. Mr. Murphy has an old coin that has 10 sides. If its shape is a polygon, how many angles does the old coin have? Remember, sides and shapes, or sorry, sides and angles match. So if it has 10 sides, it's going to have 10 angles. Okay, you guys go ahead and do number eight. And then we're gonna go over onto the back where you guys are gonna do the lesson check, just like always. And I am going to come down here and do the spiral review. How many right angles does this shape have? Well, if you just count the boxes, one, two, three, and four, four right angles. Okay. All right, Erica has eight necklaces. One fourth of the necklaces are blue. How many necklaces are blue? Well, let's do this. Let's put eight little circles and we're gonna put them into four categories because we need fourth of them. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now, one fourth of those is two necklaces. Okay, number five, what is, a, what is straight is part of a line and has two end points. Guys, that's a line segment. That is a, right where these guys end, goes from one to the other, it has an end point on either side. That's a, that's a line segment. All right, what describes this angle? Is it a right angle, which means it would have a box, which it doesn't? Is it less than a right angle, or is it more than a right angle? Well, that is much smaller than an L, so it is going to be less than. All right, guys, thanks for hanging out for 12.3. Come on back for 12.4, see you soon.